There she is. Hi. How's it going? It's great. <laughs> you look amazing. Thank you. Okay, so what you got for us today? So this soup, we both grew up eating and we love it so much and we've passed that love actually onto the kids. Peanut butter soup. We've actually made it before on the channel, but today we're doing it with a twist, a heavy twist. Is this in um, commemoration to the Sith March Ghana event? Yeah, it's Independence Day for Ghana. It is. Yeah. So today we're going to be independently African. <laughs> I love it. So yeah, peanut butter soup with hard chicken that we got from the Asian market. And we're gonna roast some vegetables. Let's get right into it so they get to see what we're talking about. Let's get right into it. Sounds about right. Okay, so the first thing you wanna do is infuse flavors into the chicken. So that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna infuse flavor into the chicken by marinating it with some aromatics. This is some deep pot. Yeah, it's the stock pot, but I figured I can also use it for my soups. And since we're a big family, it's a great size as well. It's gorgeous. Mm -hmm. So you're saying we're gonna infuse it with um, aromatics? Yeah, and flavor. Okay. Yep, so we're gonna add chicken bouillon powder. One tablespoon and seeds. Garlic paste, about a tablespoon. Um, quick question. What's the benefit of having the garlic paste against actual garlic? We're also adding um, some gochujang sauce. Some what? Wait, it's gochujang paste, Chai. right? Hot pepper paste, but it's not as hot as Africans. No. Yeah, but it's, not it is close. hot. Well, you know, it my, has some flavor. Too. You know my tolerance when it comes to pepper. So I know you are way, way, yeah, way I'm, past. I'm, I'm ghost pepper. It's hotness, so we're gonna <laughs> add about a tablespoon. Where do you get these ideas from? Yeah, we want to bring some flavor. Okay. Yeah. It's Korean. No, yeah. I know. Hi, Miss so, Korean. Gochujang hot pepper paste. That's what it means, I guess. Yeah? Yeah. It just sounds amazing coming off your lips. Gochujang. Gochujang. <laughs> and we're going to add about a tablespoon of red curry paste. Just a little bit in there. Gonna stir everything in. This is a deep pot, so it's a workout. But... All right, so stir it all in, and then to top it off, we're gonna add um, this bunch of basil. Yeah, bruised, mm. so it gives off its aroma easily. Wow, yeah. we actually went in the fight with somebody. <laughs> Got pointer nose, it's bruised. And it's usable in your Alright, so we're Love. gonna cover it and turn it on. We're gonna turn it on low heat and allow it to marinate. Okay, so for this next part, we're gonna roast some vegetables, right? Right here on the cooker. We're <laughs> gonna turn up the fire. I do have a blowtorch, but we don't have the butane. So we don't have the butane, that's my fault. I take full responsibility, baby. Yeah. I'll get you that so early tomorrow. Put our green pepper on there. We're gonna do it for all the vegetables here. So. Now, what happens when you roast vegetables? So you get a char, and then it develops this smoky taste mm. in the vegetable, and it elevates the aroma and the flavors in there. So when you when you roast, yeah, you roast it. Mm -hmm. It so, looks like grilled meat. It gives it a smoky flavor. A robust. Yeah. Exactly. Okay. So can we both agree that God roasted you for me? God roasted you for me, so no when I got all this char. <laughs> okay. All right. All right, let's see how the veggies are charring. Look at, look at, yeah, look, look at. at. So this is the um, preferred way it should look like, right? This is the intended yeah. way. Yeah. Gorgeous. 
amazing. Nice. I can see you, let's see. Amazing. Amazing. You can smell it too. Oh yeah. 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 Smell it. it smells like summer. Yeah, yeah. You look like summer. <laughs> you are my sunshine. I just like it when you blush, even though we've been married for all these years. Hey you. <laughs> what you doing? Doing some charring. <laughs> it is charring. Come say hi. Hi everyone watching us. <laughs> what did you say? Hi everyone watching us. Mom, what are you doing? Charring some. <laughs> That's how you do it. That's how you do it. No, she's showing you some love. That's what she's doing. If I had to do this, all these ain't gonna happen. <laughs> the tomatoes. They're very charred. <laughs> They're too. I love the sun. It actually really does smell like summer. Yeah. Like somewhere in the air. All right, so we got all our vegetables charred, roasted. We have aubergine. We're gonna use about half of this. So I roasted just the half part. We're gonna use the full green bell pepper. We're gonna use the full, um, it's actually small red bell pepper. It's gonna add sweetness to the soup. The onions, we're gonna use the full thing. Two Roma tomatoes, three habaneros, and some ginger. Fresh ginger. Oh, look at that. Somebody been smoking. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm, I'm actually contemplating if I should call you smoking hot, but I'm like, eh, smoking, maybe not the right word. Uh, so let me just say, you're amazingly hot. Not maybe. me, the vegetables. No, the veggies, are, they don't got nothing on you. Jason said that. <laughs> yes, he wants to be like me so bad when he grows up. Absolutely looks edible. Mm. Like it looks like it's ready to go. You can have this on mm -hmm. some rice and yeah. I, I'm actually thinking you could actually roast your veggies and just eat them. Yeah, in the summertime when you grill some, when you can't wait some meat, you can't have wait. roast veggies. So the vegetables are now gonna go inside the blender. Yeah, we're gonna make it into a smooth piece. We're also gonna add some chicken broth, about a half. All right, so we're blending it to very smooth, so. Strain the vegetables because we want a really smooth soup. So we're gonna pour it through a strainer. It's really thick. Okay, so for this next part, we're gonna add the peanut butter taste. This is three cups of peanut butter, three cups of water, microwave for three minutes in the, yeah, in the microwave. <laughs> so we're gonna add it into our soup. And we go. Yeah. And it's 
There it is. This is a lot of soup, so that was a perfect amount. It is a lot of soup. Yeah. A lot of it takes a lot of women to make a lot of soup. <laughs> <laughs> you look at that. So sweets, too hard. Mm -hmm. Is there a telltale sign to know that um peanut butter soup is ready? Yeah, as soon as you get a lot of oil pockets forming on the top, mm -hmm. you know the peanut butter is done. So we're almost there. Okay. But there's this one last part that we have to add. Can't wait. Always something else. Thanks. You're amazing, babes. All right, so for this next part, we're gonna make a paste. But first, we're gonna caramelize some shallots, some ginger, and some habanero. Right, we're gonna caramelize them. I see. <laughs> now, as usual, let me ask, what is the reason for the caramelization? Okay, so caramelizing, especially onions, Drink out its sweetness, right? Mm, so, yeah. so the purpose of this is to bring some kind of sweetness to the soup. Yeah, and the unique flavor because this is peanut butter. Mm. Soup butter. Mm. Okay. Mm. Just making sure that it doesn't burn totally. Mm. The consistency is there. Yeah. Oh wow. I think at this very point in my life, I'm a Michelin star. So here's the caramelized shallots, ginger, and habanero peppers. I blended it with some um, of the peanut butter soup. So we're gonna pour it into the blender. See, you now it easily makes this in because I blended it with a peanut butter soup. Mm. Yeah. Gotcha. Gotcha. What do we say to mommy? Thank you. And how do we appreciate mommy? Eating it. Okay. Enjoy. Jason, how does it taste? Amazing. I don't even need you to tell me because I already know what mom can do. All right, guys, enjoy yourself. Clayton, what number are you on? Three. 